Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know that KB5003214, which was this month, May 2021's optional preview build update, which rolled out for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2 and 2004 last week, is apparently causing the system tray and the taskbar to have issues and break after applying the update. And there have been user reports that um, users have seen, you know, messed up icons, icons disappearing, the taskbar going blank, icons changing order, you know, just randomly. The system tray features are not working properly, the clock and date and so on. So if you are experiencing any issues with your taskbar after applying KB5003214, then Obviously, the bug has made its way onto your system. Fortunately, I have, haven't had any problems since applying the update. And this is the update I'm talking about. If you go to your settings, update and security, view update history. And because it is an optional update, we go down to the bottom. And here we are. Cumulative update preview for Windows 10 version 21H1 KB5003214. That is the update I am talking about. Now apparently the problem is actually caused after applying the update which rolled out the news and interests feed um, to all users um, after applying that update and the simple solution um, at the moment is if you want to if you are having problems with your taskbar as in you know all those little um, problems I've just mentioned then what you can do is you can just right click on your taskbar, go to news and interests and turn the news and interests feed off. Then apparently this could solve the problem with your taskbar. And then another one obviously is, we know, which is not always recommended, is if you just go to your uninstall updates and uninstall the offending update, restart your machine, and then that should also take the problem away. And then obviously um, if that doesn't solve the problem, then we will have to wait for a fix from Microsoft or the next um, cumulative update or update that is rolled out. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.